my channel i am back on my floor with another video i have been gone for a while and i'm back again life is busy i mean i have an almost one year old now she keeps me busy work keeps me busy but i am trying my best i am just so excited because i got a few pieces from the buff bunny unfiltered collection so i have the pink and enchanted teal items so i'm just going to do like a rapid unboxing type thing i mean even though they're already unboxed but i'm just going to show you what i have and then i'm going to try it on and then let you know how they feel on and i will be comparing the micro legacy leggings to the og legacy so let's get right into it so i guess for starters this scrunchie i am obsessed with this pink this is probably literally my favorite pink in the world so um, it's kind of like a cool tone pink. This is literally my favorite color. I already opened the shorts, but I'll do kind of like a rapid fire unboxing here. So we're going to start with the Legacy, or these are the Micro Legacy shorts. They're a bit different from the OG Legacy collection. So I do have the OG leggings, so I'm going to pull those and see how they compare. But um, these are the Micro Legacy shorts, and then everything's monotone silicone logo. I'm pretty sure these will be sheer, but I just am so obsessed with this color that I like don't care. So um, I'm going to try this on and let you know how they feel on, but 6 inch, beautiful, and in their new brie, new brie, new bray, new brie fabric, I'm not sure, but so soft, literally so soft. And then I got the Buttercup Sports Bra in a lover pink, of course, and then you have that ruching here in the middle, the adjustable straps, and this really nice uh, strappy detail here on the back. Look, this is just so cute moving on the micro legacy legging i got the color enchanted teal and again here are the micro legacy leggings so the design's a bit different here in the back compared to the og and then you do have the silicone logo here on the back and last but not least i got the twisted curve sports bra in enchanted teal as well i'm actually really sad about this sports bra i thought i was getting just the regular sports bra not the one with this back and the like built-in bra but i've heard really good things about this i'm gonna try it on and see what it looks like on i was actually like in a rush when i was ordering i was at the airport and i knew these would sell out so fast and i was just rushing to <laughs> place my order but anyways um here's the back here it's more of like a full coverage not full coverage but it's more coverage than the regular sports bra and you still get that silicone logo you do get this twist here in the middle and again this doesn't have any like removable padding it's a built-in bra newbie fabric so let's try these on Here's the entire fit together sports bra and shorts. I am obsessed with this color. So the sports bra does not dig in at all. It fits so good. This ruching detail in the middle is so flattering, I think. And it does have the adjustable straps. This is so cute as well. And then I just, I think it fits so good. So stick to the size. Port wise, let's see. I don't know. I would say it's like medium. I don't know what the advertise is to be, but I think it's a pretty medium support bra on me at least. I would be comfortable taking this on kind of like any workout to be honest, but I love the bra. I think it fits so good. This is, I have not seen anyone make this pink, so this is a really good color. I love it. Now here are the shorts. And I think the shorts are definitely on the sheer side, so you'll have to stick to nude undergarments or you will definitely be able to see your underwear under this. Again, this material is just so soft, so it's not digging into the thighs. Um, it's flattering on the glutes, I would say. And it's not digging in on the waistband at all either. The shorts are definitely going to be on the sheer earth side, not squat proof unless you're wearing nude undergarments, but I probably wouldn't be wearing these on a leg day. And you could definitely like hike them up to whatever 
um, length you want. And I like the length of the waistband. I think it's a pretty good length even though it is shortened compared to the OG Legacy. Okay, before I put the other bra on, I wanted to show the combination of the Enchanted Teal with the pink. And I think it's really cute. So you can definitely mix and match the colors. And I think this is a really good combination as well. Okay, I am so impressed with this bra. I did not expect to like it. Like I genuinely thought this was gonna be terrible. Hold on, I need water. I genuinely thought this was gonna be so bad. But if it's so good, like I swear typically bras that have the built-in bra is just a big no for me, but I think this is pretty flattering. Um, if it's so good in the front, I think it's just, it fits great. So it does have that twist here in the front and the straps here are pretty nice and thick, which I love. And then the back here is more of like a full coverage, almost like a crop top, but it's a bra. So you have the back covering here. And again, this is in a size small, but I forgot to mention, I'm typically a size small in everything, literally just everything, leggings, tops, crops, whatever. And um, this one, I think definitely Maybe size up if you're in between. And I wouldn't say that because I feel like this is a very booty-ish bra. And I almost feel like it is a little bit tight here on the back. And I don't know if it's because it's like fully covered back, but I think it's a little bit tight here. But it's not uncomfortable. It's just a little bit like, I feel like it's almost sticking in here. But it's not terrible. But I don't know. Stick to your normal size or size up, I would say. And then also I didn't mention, but the pink bra, I would say the same thing, that if you are in between size up, but try to stick to your normal size in that one. So the leggings, I love these as well. I was worried when I heard that the waistband was gonna be a little shorter, that it was gonna be below my belly button, and I don't want that. And these actually fit right at like the small part of my waist. So they're pretty perfect in waist length, and then it does not dig in and here's the back and then um again you have the different legacy stitching but i think it's still pretty flattering and then let me see if i can actually let me just back up and show you the back or not the back the length i still have room here at the bottom so i am five four and a half ish five four five four and a half and these are right above my ankle, but they're, they're still room to go. So if you're taller, you'll be fine. Um, but yeah, here's the back and the front. No digging in, super soft, super comfortable. Again, you can lounge in this material like all day, all day for sure. Okay, so here are the, like, the OG Legacy. Um, sorry about all the lint on them, but here is the original Legacy leggings. Here are the Legacy leggings. The Micro Legacy leggings have a tighter or tighter seams here compared to the OG. The OGs will be a little bit more uh, separated, I guess. I don't know how to explain that. Then the actual waistband is also going to be a little shorter in the Micro Legacy leggings. So. Oh, that is so interesting. Okay, I have washed these a million times, so I don't know if that makes a difference. But just putting them side by side, like together, as you can see. The Micro Legacy leggings are a bit wider. So that's like a whole half inch, inch? I'm not sure. Like half an inch, maybe? A little bit more than that. But that's, these are both smalls. So I don't know. They probably, yeah, look how much wider they are. Excuse the dog hair, but as you can see, the Micro Legacy leggings are just a tad bit wider and the waistband is going to be just a tiny bit um, shorter with the Micro Micro Legacy leggings. So that's the difference here. And then as you can see, the black is kind of hard to see, but the micro seams are tighter and 
the legacy leggings are wider. All right, guys, so that concludes this video. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next video. I did buy a few pieces from Buff Bunny's snack collection, so that will be coming up right after this video. So stay tuned for that, and thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.